So what is a GAN charger? You may have heard of one of these before and just not known exactly what it was. So I decided to team up with a company that I've been working with for a couple of years, Ugreen, and talk about their new GAN fast charger. And this thing's pretty amazing, but the technology behind it's even more compelling. But what I thought was kind of fun is they are gonna allow me to explain it to you in almost any way I want to. And this is gonna be a lot of fun. So let's get into what exactly is a GAN charger. This is a GAN charger. I guess the video's over now but I guess I'll tell you a little bit more about it for the ones who wanna hang out. This is a really cool piece of equipment because what it basically is, is your typical power brick with some pretty extraordinary changes inside the uh, actual charger itself. You see, gallium nitride chargers were pretty much everywhere at CES 2020. And the reason that they're so cool is that they're typically smaller than current chargers. And this is because gallium nitride chargers don't require as many components as silicone chargers. The material is able to conduct higher voltages over time rather than silicon. They're much more efficient, which means a lot of that energy won't turn to heat like some of your other power bricks. Have you ever used a power brick that got really hot when you touched it. Well, these won't do that as much because they're so much more efficient. And instead of turning that to heat, it just puts that energy into your devices. And what makes this particular one so special is that it's a hundred Watts, which means you have three USB-C and one USB-A on here, and they can use a tremendous amount of power. You can fast charge multiple devices at once. Typically when you buy one of these, one port is uh, PD, is power delivery, where you can get that extra speed, and then the rest aren't. This one, you have a hundred Watts to spread across these ports. So if you have a couple of devices that need some fast charging, this is the one for you. So for example, you might wonder if you can fast charge your MacBook Pro that you just got last year and your iPhone 13. Well, let's take a look. As you can see, the two ports will combine for up to 100 watts of power, which gives fast charging to your MacBook and your iPhone at the same time. So for an iPhone 13, you can get over 21 watts of power, which means it can be charged to 59% in 30 minutes and fully charged in 90 minutes. Now I should probably mention that manufacturers like Samsung sometimes have their own proprietary fast charging methods. So anything above and beyond that will be only with their power bricks, but everything else will work just as fast on this charger. How much faster does it charge than an ordinary Apple five watt charger? As you can see here, the iPhone 13 was charged with a normal five watt charger for 30 minutes and the battery's at 17%. Of course, with the GAN charger, it's at 57% in that same 30 minutes. This is the difference between coming home, quickly charging your phone, grabbing something to eat and being able to go back outside and I guess just having to stay home and, and and not doing anything because you can't leave the house with your without your phone, right? That's not something that anyone does. Now, some people worry about the wear and tear on their battery when they're super fast charging their phone. And that's a pretty good question. Let's talk about that. The Ugreen 100 watt fast charger minimizes the wear and tear on the phone's battery. The biggest danger for the battery is temperature and fast charging can increase that smartphone battery's temperature. But this charger communicates with your device and intelligently regulates the strength of the current to minimize your battery's temperature during charging. It uses Ugreen's Power X dynamic allocation technology for allocating the power between two or more devices simultaneously to enhance the charging experience while ensuring safe charging of your device. But of course, you don't want to do things that are stressing your phone, like playing games while fast charging. That will definitely wear out your battery a little bit faster because it will induce heat. So if you can try to avoid playing games while charged, fast charging your phone. I mean, you could do it. It literally will work, but you know, uh, maybe, maybe you should give it a break. And like I said before, this thing will actually generate less heat than a regular charger. When outputting the same power, the GAN fast charger will have a higher conversion efficiency and charge at a lower temperature than ordinary silicon chargers. Ugreen engineers have adjusted and tested this design many times to control the heat generation. It's something that they're absolutely passionate about to make sure you get a product that will work every time. As a matter of fact, look at some of the weird things they did to this thing. They actually did a drop test. Who drop tests? A power charge, who does this? You green does because they care about the quality of the product. This is actually kind of insane to me. You may have seen phones drop. I've never seen a charger drop, but this is part of what they do. They really care that much. And when people ask if this thing is safe, I laugh in their faces because let me tell you something, they are testing everything on this thing. When they're doing electromagnetic compatibility testing, my gosh, look at what's going on here. During the electromagnetic compatibility test, they want to detect the effect of EMC fields on the human body. Body. And it's past the EMC test, so it will do no harm to your human body in normal use. By the way, why would you be so close to your charger to, to have problems with your human body? That's you plug this into the wall and then you walk away. You just, that's what you should do. 
So how does fast charging exactly work? I just wanna say it's magical. This thing takes power from your wall, converts it into super juice and puts it into your phone or your laptop or your, or your, or your iPad or your Tab S or your Galaxy Note or your Fold, or you understand. And if you wanna know more about the actual internals of this thing, here's some cool things you can look at. I gotta be honest, man, this one right here kind of flipped me out. Look at this test. I don't know what's going on here, but whatever it is, it looks really important. And look at this. They actually wanna know if this thing's making a lot of noise. I, I gotta be honest, I, I've i never heard one of these things make any noise. And obviously uh, Ugreen has this covered because they put microphone, look at how expensive this room looks better than my studio. And oh my God, what are they doing? They're putting this thing, they're trying to light this thing on fire. Why? Why are they lighting? Why? Well, I know why. Because the outer shell of this thing is fire retardant, which means you don't have to worry about this catching fire, which is what some people worry about. You know, a new fast charger, you're kind of worried all the heat and fire. Look, they tried to set it on fire and it didn't work. Look, they even put this thing in something that looks like a sauna. I mean, don't take this in a sauna with you, but it, it environmentally, this thing is super safe. This is probably the safest charger you can buy that's gonna output 100 watts of power to multiple devices at the same time. Ugreen has you covered. I'll have a link in the description below with some more details about how you can buy this and where you can get it from. Ugreen has been paying attention to what you need from your chargers and has delivered it here in this 100 watt beast of a charger.